What to know about Rigby, Idaho. Hi guys, welcome back. If you're new here, I'm Rebecca. I'm a realtor based here in Southeastern Idaho and I make videos every single week talking about pretty much just all things life in Idaho, things to do here, tips for buying or selling here, tips for moving here, and kind of just life in general as a wife and a mom and a realtor because my life gets crazy sometimes and I just like to bring you guys along with me for it. But in today's video, I honestly cannot believe I have never made a video about this, but I wanted to talk a little bit about Rigby, Idaho. It's a small town, like 10 to 15 minutes north of Idaho Falls. I love Rigby. I spend a lot of time there and I can't believe that I haven't done a video on this. So here we go. Let's jump on in. Okay. So like I said, Rigby is just a few minutes north of Idaho Falls. It's about 10 to 15, maybe 20 minutes north, um, just depending on what part of town you're in. It's between Idaho Falls and Rexburg. So kind of really just in the middle, um, probably about 10 to 15 minutes from either city. And I think as of 2020, the population was about 4,500. So definitely a small town. Um, it's kind of lumped into the greater Idaho Falls area sometimes just because it's so close, but on its own, it is only about 4,500 people. And there is a little bit of a gap between Idaho Falls and Rigby. So it's not, I wouldn't call it a suburb exactly, but it is super close, which is nice for coming into town and shopping or going out to eat or anything like that. And a lot of people who live in Rigby do come into Idaho Falls or Rexburg quite a bit just because they're obviously the closest towns that have a little bit more than Rigby. But Rigby does have a super cute little downtown area. Um, it has a Brolums, which is a local grocery store kind of in the like Eastern Idaho region. Brolums was actually started there um, and it's a super nice grocery store. I go all the time here in Idaho Falls. Um, one of our favorite restaurants is actually in Rigby too. It's called Little Mike's Barbecue. It's amazing. Um, so if you're in Rigby, definitely go check it out. So it does have a few little shops and restaurants and things like that, but for most of your other things, you're probably going to be coming into Idaho Falls or up to Rexburg um, if you want to go to Walmart or Costco or Target or anything like that. But again, it's super close, so it's not like a hassle to go into either of those towns for anything. Job-wise in Rigby, it's kind of the same as Idaho Falls and all over this area. A lot of people work out of the site, which is INL or Idaho National Laboratory. Um, that makes up a pretty good chunk of the people who work here. Um, like I said, Brolums uh, was also or is also headquartered in Rigby, so that kind of comes from some of the jobs there. Um, Melaleuca is also headquartered here, and they make up a lot of the workforce too. So it's kind of all over the board. Um, with what industries people work in and everything like that, but those are some of the core employers, honestly, just kind of in the region, I would say. Rigby, same as honestly all over this area of Idaho, has some amazing fishing. Um, a lot of the Snake River runs through Rigby and around Rigby. Um, Henry's Fork and South Fork are some blue ribbon fishing areas, which are amazing fishing areas, and they're super close to Rigby, probably within 10 to 20 minutes. Um, you can be out fishing and it is amazing. My husband and I go out there all the time. And fun fact about Rigby, the inventor of the television is actually from there. So there's a little museum in Rigby, um, all about TVs and everything like that. And second fun fact, um, Jefferson County, which is the county that Rigby is in, is in the largest cottonwood forest west of the Mississippi. So this time of year, especially, there is cotton just kind of floating all over the place. So if you see white stuff floating through the air, especially in the summertime, that's what it is. But yeah, like I said, I love Rigby. I think it's just the cutest little town. I love that it's kind of more of a country feel and a small town feel, even though honestly all of Eastern Idaho is kind of like that. It's really like that. But like I said, it's still only like 10 to 15 minutes from Idaho Falls South or Rexburg up North. So it's really easy and convenient if you want to get into town to do some shopping or go out to eat or whatever it may be. But yeah, that's honestly it for today. I wanted to just throw some little fun facts about Rigby your way. If you like these videos, um, kind of covering the different towns around Idaho Falls a little bit more, let me know because I know I need to do a better job of talking about them and I honestly love them. So let me know if you want to see more of these. If you have any questions about Rigby or about moving here or buying or selling or whatever it may be, feel free to drop them below. Connect with me on social media, whatever you want to do. 
I am always happy to help however I can. And until my next video, I'll see you guys next time. Bye guys.